wife of the Nigerian Inspector General of Police, Elizabeth Egbetokun, is on a visit to River State. Mrs. Egbetokun, who doubles as the president of the Police Officers' Wives Association, otherwise known as POA, is in Potako to inaugurate a shopping complex built by the state branch of the association. And by the special grace of God, we have done that. We are able to empower our women, those who need our support, and that is what we have done. She also uses the opportunity to thank the River State Government for the immense support POA continues to enjoy in the state. And uh, we can see that you are taking good care of the police around here. We are so happy. You might think what you're doing is nothing, but it goes a long way to assure the police officers, their wives, that even if they're no more, somebody is there to look out for them. So I want to encourage you to continue to do that. While applauding POA for its numerous feats, including the support for widows, Governor Siminalai Fubara has a very important task he would like the wives of the country's police officers to do advise their husbands to carry out their duties professionally and without bias. Don't advise your husbands. Let them continue to stand on the path of truth. It doesn't matter who asks God today. Nothing lasts forever. But what lasts forever is the truth. Live a life where when this name is mentioned today, you're the IG. Tomorrow you won't be there. When that name is mentioned somewhere, oh, this is a good man. You won't be there again to defend. For now, the name can make you pass. He further wants them to pray for River State and strongly advise their husbands to stand on the path of truth. We are the head, but you are the neck that controls the head. So please, be helping us. Pray for River State. Intercede for us. There are places where we cannot reach, but our message today is going to those places. Please, that is the request we are making as a government. We do not want any trouble. What we are doing here is governance. We know that we have started. One day our own will end and we will leave. So because we know that, we have decided to take the path of peace. In another development, the wife of the Nigerian president, Oluremi Tinubu, has through her pet project, the Renewed Hope Initiative, provided support to 1,000 petty traders across the 23 local government areas of River State. Represented at the event by the wife of the governor, Valerie Fubara, Senator Oluremi Tinubu says the gesture is aimed at driving economic growth and enhancing the livelihoods of women petty traders. A total of 1 billion 850 million naira will be disbursed to 37,000 women petty traders across the nation. The grant provided today is to assist our women petty traders in overcoming some of their business challenges, expand their businesses, create more jobs, and contribute more robustly to our economy.